turn our gaze to the night sky for Star Watch with meteorologist Victoria Cavallari. Victoria, what do we need to be on the lookout for this week? Well, Elizabeth, we're going to be able to see several planets in the sky this week. A couple of these planets you're going to be able to see all at once. But first off, I want to start with Tuesday. Now, we've got the last quarter moon happening on Tuesday. Remember, this is not going to be visible to the naked eye because of kind of the positioning here. Wednesday through Friday nights, though, you are going to be able to see the moon near Jupiter. And I want to show you this image so you get an idea of what to look for in the sky. Notice how the moon kind of increases. It gets higher and higher up in the sky as we go throughout the next few nights there. But Jupiter is going to stay in a pretty similar spot. Now, in order to see Jupiter, you want to make sure that you're looking 45 minutes after after sunset and you want to be looking to the southwest. In addition to this, Saturday morning is when you're going to be able to see Mercury, Mars, and Venus all at the same time. You want to look southeast before sunrise. This will give you an idea of where those planets are going to be located. Venus is a little bit higher up in the sky and Mars, of course, is kind of in the middle there, more of an orange glow to that planet. Don't worry, if you forgot any of these details, they are posted every Monday on WAT.com under my Star Watch blog. We'll be right back.